Hey guys, TGT Tutorials here today bringing you a video on classical conditioning and how it links to phobias. Classical conditioning is a learning process which builds up an association between two stimuli through repeated pairings. Ivan Pavlov explained classical conditioning. Pavlov was studying eating in dogs by measuring their saliva. Sometimes his dogs started to produce saliva before their food arrived. He thought this was because they could hear the footsteps of the person carrying the food. To test his idea, he decided to condition their dogs. He did this by ringing a bell when the dogs were presented with their food. At first he rang the bell, the dog didn't salivate. This was the neutral stimulus. Then he rang the bell and gave the dog some food. This was the conditioning process as he repeated it many times. Over time, the dog learned to associate the bell with the food, making it the conditioned stimulus. Then, when he rang the bell, the dog saliva even there wasn't any food there, making it the conditioned response. So now when the bell rang, the dog thought he was getting food and saliva even though there was no food there. This is because the dog has learned to associate the bell with the food. This then can be linked into how some people get phobias. For example, a little girl is playing on the beach in shallow water. She catches her flip-flop on some stones, trips and hurts herself. Her dad picks up and she's wet and frightened. The fear the girl feels when she falls is associated with the sea. When she gets home, she is afraid of having a bath, even though the accident happened in the sea. A phobia has made her afraid of water in other situations. This is called generalisation. However, if a conditioned stimulus is repeated too many times without the unconditioned stimulus, the conditioned response is lost. This is called extinction, and it's how some people lose their phobias.